hey guys good morning and welcome back to my channel thank you for clicking on this video remember to like subscribe comment and share today is Sunday and um, I'm not feeling so good so right now I'm heading off to the urgent care to get a checkup to see what is going on so I'm on my way to the urgent care now so guys I will keep you posted please remember to press the like button if you're not yet subscribed please go ahead and subscribe now so and turn your notification bell on to all so whenever time I post you will be notified okay I I don't know um I think one of the thing is to I get eye drops from I did the surgery and one of one of those eye drops whenever time I take it it send me in a state of depression and uh, I think that that is what happening to me right now because the hole around here is very stiff I just feel I'm not feeling myself so I think more or less too this eye drop is giving me that effect and I don't know if it it rise my pressure because each time I use that drops my pressure feel like it go up so I'm gonna get that checked out so stay tuned guys catch you later so guys I'm here I did a COVID test already and I'm just waiting now to see the doctor to see what is going on okay keep you posted now I'm waiting to speak with the doctor just take my weight and uh, my temperature my pressure is 150 over 90, 94 that is too high so I'm waiting to speak with the doctor and see what's going on what I might do I'm feeling stress and I think that's contribute to it because of the medication all is that stress I think that contributes to my pressure being high. But anyhow, let's talk to the doctor and see what's going on. Yeah. Is that the only medication that you needed? That's the That's only one, one, yeah. I'm sending it right over. Do you have a primary care doctor? Yes. Okay, so I'm sending it. You want to send it with refills or no refills? Um, refills. Yes, refills so and I'm going to make an appointment to see my... Okay, but it's hard to get to her now. That's okay. No, because I was... She told me that it started with a C. I'm like... No, it's, it's hydrochloric. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> and so I was like, I don't think this is it, but it's yeah. like three, and you said it. I'm Joel, I'm the PA here. Hi. Hello. You're the Thank you. All right. Any medical history besides the blood pressure? No. Yeah. I don't want to deal with my eyes. Um, cataract? Or and glaucoma. And glaucoma. The thing is, there's a um, medication that they gave to me. So guys, I'm getting some medication and um, for the stiff neck, she said if it feel any worse or I feel any short of breath or thing, I have to go to the emergency room. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to make an appointment tomorrow to see my primary care. I know that is going to take a while to get a day to see her, but I'll just have to keep monitoring my pressure and see how much I can relax myself and not stress myself for it. Oh my God, guys. So uh, now I'm going to get those at the pharmacy. And also she's giving me some muscle relaxer because let me tell you something hair is so tight 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 but what she's saying if I um, feel any have any symptoms of blurriness short of breath things like that I should just go to the ER so you know sometime in life it, it don't even worth it to stress and worry about anything or what people has been doing you know and I tell myself I want to put that behind me. I try not to let what people do affect me. But sometimes, you know, it's it's very hard when it's in your face 
and you can't do anything about it at the time you know you have to just I'm a person like this I, I, I love to be happy I'm a happy person I'm a happy person and my happiness I, I love my happiness at home I my home is always have to be comfortable so I spend time you know to make it as comfortable as possible and when you know you leave work where it is stressful and you go home and want to have you know a little peace and quiet and not in peace and quiet but you know to have that person around that you can laugh have fun you know it's it's hard I don't want to get too much into it but let me tell you something the devil is a liar and I, I, I tell him I, I'm putting myself first I'm putting me first I'm doing me and I have been through this couple of years back and I tell myself last year I'm not going through it again this year I have to do better I don't want no stress I want to be happy I don't have any young kids so why I can't live and be happy you know I'm, I'm not letting anybody steal my joy anymore so I'm just gonna do me and let me be happy so I don't want to deal with this pressure thing anymore because I realize whenever time certain things happen you know you depress the pressure go up and I, I just don't want to deal with it in your guys later